So Tyrese, you've just signed your first professional contract. How does that feel? Yeah, I'm over the moon. It's something I've been dreaming for since I've been at the club. You know, I've been here nearly 10 years, 10, over 10 years. So I'm really pleased to get it over the line. You are right, you've been here for a long time. Can you just tell us a little bit about your journey so far of when you joined up to now? Yeah, so I've been here since I was six or seven years old, uh, signed that young, and ever since then I've just managed to progress, progress through the age groups and just managed to get my contract every year. What would you say has been the sort of the, the key to you, sort of seeing it all out and, and making it all the way through to your first professional deal? You know, uh, my attitude, I'm quite harsh on my attitude, make sure it's top-notch every time. Um, obviously my ability as well has got me here as well but most of it just being a leader out there through the age groups bringing everyone together making sure all the boys bond and just being a captain out there and tell me a little bit about some of your physical attributes yeah well through through my age groups playing up I've been a number nine target man uh, getting hold of the ball playing back to goal um, that's that's how we've been playing playing off me linking up with play and yes helped quite a lot through the years Ian's described you as um, someone who's got a bit of goal scoring ability as well. Uh, would, you, would you say that's true? Yeah, yeah. I've been top goal scorer most years uh, for the eighteen to two years in a row. Uh, enjoy it, love scoring. Nothing, not not a better feeling than scoring. And of course, you made your first team debut away at Haven and Waterlooville in the FA Trophy. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about a little bit about that day. <laughs> yeah, that was mixed emotions. That came on, got the penalty, got two yellows, and got sent off, but. I loved every minute of it. I won't take anything away from it. Following that and towards the end of the season, you've spent a fair bit of time in and around the, the first team. How have you found that experience of training with them on a, on a, on a regular basis? Yeah, the uh, first week I came in, I find it a bit tough to get used to the tempo and the physicality. But from that, I've really got to grips with it and I've been uh, impressed with how I've been performing and training. Uh, before my injury, I was doing really well and then I got injured. So I have to come back stronger in the next season. Tell me a little bit about that injury. Yeah, just micro fracture in the knee. I've been on the crutches for four weeks. Um, got a rehab to do when I come back on the 12th, but hopefully I won't be too long till I'm back playing. And obviously once you're back to full fitness, what are your personal ambitions and hopes for, for the coming season? Uh, I'm hoping to go out on loan, get some men's football, get experience, and then hopefully do well out there and come back and be fighting for the bench or starting 11 if I can.